Sound effects are a really great way to get attention to your videos as well as keep your audience interested. So today I'm going to show you how to add sound effects to your videos on the inside of CapCut. Now, if you're someone and you have been saying to yourself, how are people doing this with their videos? I don't understand it. Then this is going to be a basic tutorial for you. Uh, me personally, I'm not a really big editor, but I do understand the value of not just filming a video and leaving the way it is, but I see the value, especially a short video about putting text on screen, sound effects and things of that nature. And so I want to make this an easy, easy tutorial for you. So let's go ahead and get into it. So first you want to go ahead and add your video, of course, on the inside of CapCut. That way you're able to do all the different things here. And then all we're gonna do is, we're gonna go up here and then we're gonna go ahead and click on audio. That's where you're gonna find the actual sound effects. Then you're gonna go ahead and click on sound effect. And what it's gonna do, is gonna give you a series of different things to choose from, but we're actually going to uh, search for what we are looking for, okay? So I'm gonna go up here into the search bar and I'm gonna type in beep. Okay, and that's just the sound of beeping. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and hit enter, and then here are some different sounds for beeping. So I'm gonna click on them so we can hear them. Okay, let's hear that again. All right. Okay, but then also what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna type in typing, because oftentimes we love using a typing sound. So let's go ahead and click on there. Here's another one. I like that one, all right? So then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that sound and we're gonna click on the plus sign here, all right? And so now it actually put it here, but we actually want this to be within the actual video, okay? We don't want it to be at the end, all right? So right now this video is a little bit long, so we're just gonna put it right here where it is. And then now what we have to do is we have to, of course, tell CapCut where we want this to sound to start and where we want it to stop. Because right now this sound is actually, let me see, it is about a minute long and we probably don't want something that long so we want to uh, tell it where we want it to go but first is before I show you the sound I'm gonna actually add some text so that it will feel a little bit better okay so I'm gonna go ahead and click up here and click on default text and then in this box I'm gonna do here is gonna say how to add sound effects in CapCut Okay, all right, so we want this to kind of be on one line. All right, let's go ahead and do this here. All right, there we go. So now we're gonna go ahead and choose our font. I love uh, that one. And then we are gonna choose this background, okay? And so then we're gonna put this here. But in addition to that, now obviously this is a little bit loaded, but you can see what I'm doing here, so you can utilize this, okay? I actually want this to show up on screen as an animation, all right? So we've got the text here. And what I wanna do up here is I'm gonna go ahead and click on animation. Now technically this video is about adding uh, sound effects, but I want you to be able to get the whole experience. So I'm gonna click on animation and then I'm gonna go and actually find where it's kind of like typing. So here's one for you. All right, so actually what I'm gonna do is I want to have, here is the text and I want the text to appear kind of slowly, right? and also where the sound starts. So before we do that, let me go ahead and click play on that. That way you can see it. And we made some of the videos clickable. All right. As a guide so for you. So now, you what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna make the, I wanna make the animation a little bit longer if I can. All right, so there's the animation. And right now it says 0.5 seconds. I kinda wanna make it maybe, um, maybe two seconds long. All right, okay. And we made some of the videos clickable. All right, you see that? Okay. okay, as a guide for you. So you so then let's go ahead and get rid of that there and let's see it here again. I know this is video is kind of loaded. Here we go. All right, so you see the text that's happening there or whatever. Okay, so now what we want to have happen is we want the sound to actually, excuse me, we want the typing sound to actually start where our text, when our text starts appearing on screen. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna cut off that point there because that's not where the text, where the sound actually starts. And then we are gonna go ahead and put this right over here to make sure it's starting right at the same time. Okay, so let's do a little bit. Come on, sound, just a little bit. Okay, now let's go ahead and press play on this and you will see. Thank you, and we make some of the videos as a 
Okay, so now of course the, the text is stopped, it stopped, you know, back here. So we're gonna go ahead and split that sound down here. That way it can stop and then it can stop right when the text stops. Let's do it one more time. And we make some of the videos as a guide for you. Okay, so it also goes a little longer still. So we're again, we're gonna take it all the way back here. All right, one more time. And we make some of the videos. Okay. As a guide for you. And so, so you really what you may build. notice is that that sound is actually pretty loud. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna make that sound just a little bit quieter. Okay. So let's just see if the volume here. All right. No, that's muted. Let me see. How can we make this sound a little bit less? I don't see the feature where we can make the whole. One. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna double tap on the t on the, the text, the sound of the text, and then over here where it says volume, I'm gonna actually turn that down a little bit because it's really loud, okay? All right, so now let's hear it together. Here we go. You and we made some of the videos clickable as a guide for you so you can really get a visual for what we were talking let's about. Let's try it again. The videos clickable there we go. as a guide for you so you can really get a visual. One for more what time. Make some of the videos clickable as a guide for you so you can really right. get a visual for what so, we're talking about. One more about. time. Let's if make you, this uh, audio uh, a bit louder. Um, let's see. Video audio. Okay. So we're going to make audio louder and the text back here. Here we go. We made some of the videos clickable. Hold on. <laughs> All right. Let's bring this back. All right. So then just a little bit more. And we made some of the videos clickable. Okay, so that's how you do it. And you can do this whether it's going to be in a long horizontal video or it could be a short video. But it's a really great way to add some depth to your video. So obviously you saw me add text, you saw me add the animation, and then you all also saw me add the sound. But the whole point of the video was more so the sound. So if you found this valuable, be sure to let me know in the comments. Let me know what other tutorials you would like for me to do. I will gladly do them here on this channel. So make sure you subscribe. That way when I do the video you asked me to do, that you actually see it, okay? So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you follow my channel and I can't wait, cannot wait to see you in the next video.